September 3, 1939. Two days after Adolf Hitler's forces invade Poland, Britain and France declare war on Nazi Germany. British Prime Minister Neville Chamberlain, whose policy of appeasing Hitler was meant to prevent what becomes World War II. Yet I cannot believe that there is anything more or anything different that I could have done and that would have been more successful. 1783, official end of the American Revolution as the United States and Britain signed the Treaty of Paris. Under the treaty, Britain recognizes the independence of its 13 breakaway colonies. 2004, a three-day hostage siege at a school in southern Russia ends in bloody chaos. Chechen militants who seized the school in Beslan set off bombs while Russian commandos storm the building. More than 330 people, most of them children, are killed in the carnage. 1976, Viking 2, the unmanned American space probe, lands on Mars. The NASA craft takes the first close-up color photos of the red planet's surface. And 1970. I want to say this, that it's a great game. It's a game of great lessons. In Washington, NFL Hall of Fame coach Vince Lombardi dies of cancer. Lombardi, who led the Green Bay Packers to win the first two Super Bowls, was 57 years old. Today in History, September 3rd. Camille Bohan in the Associated Press.